Hi, my name is Laura Barron. I'm the founder of Yoga Bee, the first yoga studio opening in Toronto's path. Um, today we're going to go through a few quick, easy poses that you can do in your work clothes, in your office as part of your regular work day. Um, that will really increase your energy levels, focus uh, your attention on your work, and give you some great clarity. So the first, first one that we're going to do is the modified fire log pose. So placing your feet about hip distance apart, take your right ankle and cross it over your left knee. Place your left hand on your right foot and your right hand on your right knee. Now, you might feel a lot of sensation in your outer right hip just from going this deep into the pose. That's great. If you do, just focus on lengthening up through your spine, bringing your shoulder blades down your back and breathing deeply here. If you don't feel sensation in the outer edge of your uh, right hip here, then to deepen the pose, you can start slowly and mindfully leaning forward any amount, taking care to keep your neck long, your gaze slightly in front of you, <clears throat> and your back straight. Once you feel the sensation on the outer edge of your right hip, stay right there and just focus on deep breathing. After you've taken about three to five deep breaths in this pose, you can come up once again slowly and mindfully and repeat on the left side. The second pose we're going to do in our office yoga sequence is a seated twist. Twists are really great for maintaining and increasing spinal flexibility, which tends to decrease over our lifetimes. Um, so doing an easy twist every day will uh, maintain the flexibility in the spine and the longevity in the joints. Um, as an extra added bonus, when you release from a twist, um, blood is pumped through the body um, and you get a quick hit of energy from the extra circulation that you're getting from releasing the twist. So we're going to start with our feet about hip distance apart. We'll start on the right hand side, take your right hand, put it on the outer edge of the left knee and take the left hand and put it anywhere behind you that's comfortable and feels stable. So on your armrest or the back of your chair. Um, and then making sure that you feel grounded through your sits bones and grounded through your heels. You're gonna use the, the right hand as a resistance point to push yourself into the twist. So on an exhalation, you'll push your right hand against your left knee and twist towards the left hand side. On your inhalations, focus on lengthening up through the spine and on the exhalations deepen the twist and turn your gaze further towards the left. Stay here for three to five breaths and then release and do it on your left hand side. So the last pose in our desk yoga sequence is a gentle back bend uh, called the seated locust pose and this, this pose is great for opening up the front body stretching out the shoulders and creating an opening across the chest. So the way we're going to start this pose is once again putting our feet hip distance apart. Take your hands and interlace them behind the back, stretching out your arms as much as is comfortable for you. And then on your next inhalation, you're going to lift up through your sternum, lengthening out the spine and really feeling that opening across your chest. At the same time, let your shoulders drop down and your arms lengthen out any amount, gazing up towards the ceiling. If you want to get a deeper stretch through your shoulders, you can start to lift your hands up away from your low back and from your chair, just until you feel the sensation across the front of your shoulders. And then once again, breathing deeply here for three to five breaths. When you're done, come out slowly. And if that feels good, you can try it again.